and DJ T afterwards in the bracket. Ooh, okay. So we are going to see a pick from Shao, Shaolin from MF Slayer, and Sonic, Sonic Fox is going back to his roots. But not exactly. He's going well, back to his roots from season two. Five. His his character. Let me his just sorry, that's roots. Yeah, his, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Definitely, this is the character that Sonic Fox basically became known for at the start yeah. of the game. And what a good start from Slayer. Here we go, already in the corner, and an overhead opens it up. Slayer trying to make a very early statement. He gets a really good Oki after that uh, drop. Like, that is one of the best things about Shaolin that's really underrated, is the fact that every single one of his combos ends in a very, yeah. very good hard knockdown. And Sonic Fox able to get out of that situation with a nice jump over, but here comes Slayer again, and he's going to break. I'm surprised he wanted to use that meter there. Yeah. He is at quite a life disadvantage, and against Shaolin, oh. that's big. No, no, with punish. Got out of there. No ants here. Oh, just goes for the command grab with the tick throw. Very nice, and Slayer does not have enough meter to armor, but he can do some uh, that was smart. things. That was very smart from Slayer to take the last hit of that. Oh, that was not the smart it. <laughs> Fortunately, so close to ending that round, but Sonic Fox with the confidence to break and actually make a comeback. You know, almost every single time that he has had a big life disadvantage and I've said, oh, that was a questionable break, he's won. Yeah, so he's, I he should just stop saying that. <laughs> Oh, hits him oh, with the low. I think Slayer tried to get up and actually punish that, but breaks the armor. Very nice. Oh, this should be big. Oh, no, didn't go the full, the full conversion. Just oh, with a normal safe low string. damage sitting on Caltrops, burning the meter. This is very close. Can Frank do it? Oh, he goes for a reset. Walks back, goes for the low. That's a very common strategy from Shaolin players. Oh, and he Ooh. tried to get out, but stance into two, I believe that is, correct? Stance four. Yeah, stance four. Win. Yeah, it's Which one is two? two? Two is the upshot. Ah, you're right. You're right. One See, that's why I'm here. I wasn't sure. <laughs> I asked the question, and you corrected me. Thank you, sir. There is a new yeah, it's, Honestly, this is a variation that we still don't see played almost at all. I mean, Sonic Fox did win Season 2 Finals with Gunslinger. Right, but, but I mean, he got there mainly <laughs> by using another character. Quite a few other characters, yeah. actually. But regardless, I'm surprised that we haven't seen more people pick this variation up. I mean, it's, it, uh, Sonic Fox has proven that it is solid. I think I think it's really, really solid in keeping your opponent out and also controlling that space, that neutral in front of you, yeah. where a lot of characters like Kung Jin might excel, or even Sonya, in that mid-range game. He can shut that down with Gunslinger. I agree, and he's he's very heavy on space control. Plus, he has the mix-ups once he gets in, so right. that really leads to his solidity. And in this situation, like last game, where Slayer was at a huge life disadvantage, getting through that Forest of Fireballs is very tough. Oh no, and armoring through. I've noticed that Slayer has hit Sonic Fox with quite a few overheads. So it's got to be a tell to Slayer as well as to Fox. And that's where the mind games come in. And we should be within chip life here. Oh, and oh, just a rock of hand grab. Fox is getting another chance. That was a good block, and he closes it out. Down one with the overhead. I like it. Well, what he tried to do right there was break the armor because the upshot that he did at the end of that, the stance two, the anti. Oh, oh what a good nice. run, Sonic Fox! I like I was saying the upshot actually hits twice immediately, so it breaks all armor in the game, even six frame armor. Trying to trade there with the shock run, but that that money shot. I'm gonna call it the money shot. <laughs> all right, it's a good name for it. I'll give you that. Shoots one. the money. You would think that, I mean, he's, he's like, basically his whole character is that he'll do anything for money, so why is he wasting on those shots? Up. Right, well, I mean, I guess they're just cheap outworld pennies? Uh, Maybe. I guess, I don't know. Those pennies are strong. So hard to anti-air that Kung Jin jump in. He has some of the best jump ins in the game. Again, breaking the armor with the 1-1. One, one. Wow, and still going for the same armored move. Yeah. I'm surprised that he's continuing to try that when he's to been be, broken like To be honest, times. I like that though because he's showing Fox that he's not afraid. True. If I oh. need to use this tool to get out, I'm going to use this tool to get out. Are you going to stop me every time? And there it is again. It is a really good armor move. It catches people jumping over, it catches people in a lot of weird situations. It's overhead, it's safe, it hits twice, so it breaks its own armor. Oh, no anti air from Slayer, and now he's caught in a bad position. Oh, and he can't run past can't. the Caltrops. Oh, Ooh. but he slices him. Yeah, that's With the Chakram throw. I mean, Chakrams are extremely good zoning tools. They do 7%, which is very high for a projectile in this I agree. game. And you can guide them, you can do low versions. And once you do condition your opponent that you will be throwing projectiles, he has some of the best anti-airs in the game. Is that... Oh, 
Oh, nope, still sticking with Gunslinger. Still slicking. Slicking. Still slicking with Gunslinger. Stick with it, slick. Got my tongue to twisters. <laughs> I twisted. Big black bugs bleed blue blood. <laughs> uh, <laughs> don't look at me like that, man. You're creeping me out. All right, so we are going into game three. They're tied Shout up one to piece. Slayer. He's level 16 online. <laughs> Get him, buddy. I don't think he's ever played online in his life. Ooh, just, just hit got, the jump over. Maybe he was trying to do a stand one at here or a down one, I don't know, but he got caught. Here we go, down one into a confirm. Very nice, use the side switch combo. Depending on what jump attack you use in that combo, you can either side switch or not side switch. That was oh, a great choice. Nice play. armor through the gap of the shock from coming best. back. And he's basically chip here. Happiness if he can just touch him with anything, he should be able to... Ooh, he could have stanced into gun three, gun stance three, and uh, that would have been chip, but... Right, and that's the anyway. multiple shooting pistols to the, towards the ground. Round Correct. Two. That will be 10% in his chip, even without the last game. Ooh, really, really far whip throw right there. Yeah. Didn't expect the movement. Oh, nice. Uses the meter burn just in case it didn't hit to make it safe. Yeah, and on top of making it safe, it always gives it that second hit. So it actually gets a larger hitbox to catch people jumping away like we just saw. Ooh, and just respecting Aaron Black on the couch. I like drops. that grab. That was a very ballsy move, but it worked out for Slayer finally getting a load of catch. And again, another overhead. This is huge, Slayer. Ooh, you can actually fuzzy block that low overhead mix up in the, that part of that string, so there's no real excuse to get hit. Oh no, this is bad news. Slayer does have a bar, though. Doesn't block the third hit. Interesting. Oh, okay. And that's the faster wake up. That's the one that Sonic Fox will never be able to armor break. And he got hit, so I think he was trying. But maybe, possible. yeah. Nice, just gets I like out of there. Bash. That was clean. Good air to air. Slayer now pushing Sonic Fox towards the corner, but he keeps it mid screen. Okay. Oh, and he goes for the reset. That was so clean. He just did walk up slowly into instant neutral jump punch. All right, here's the chance for the... Oh, we can make a comeback here. That was a tricky little reset, though. It was. Oh, but drops the combo, unfortunately. This is going to be really tough. Oh, that's a punish, but no punish by... Oh, no, Fox. getting something started. That's not what you want from Sonic Fox. There's nice. the armor. Slayer goes up two to one. Maybe he's going to do it again. It's quite possible. Surprisingly, we haven't seen Alien wins. from Sonic Fox. Yeah, or yes. any of his other characters. I mean... Honestly, it seems like when he really wants to win, he still Defender. goes Cassie a lot of the time. I'm, right, but I'm I mean, surprised we haven't seen either of those. Correct, two. but we've seen so much acidic from him this season. I mean, that's the character he's been dominating the season with, and he's actually just going to stick to Aaron Black. Wow, sticking with his guns. Literally. <laughs> God, I'm. Uh, I think uh, you're you're catching whatever sickness I have. Yeah. The bad jokes. It's gross. I'm gonna have to put you down soon. Incurable. Round one. Five. Right, so yeah, surprisingly, just sticking with Gunslinger. Ooh, that's a bad start. Kung Jin gets really big conversions off of every single hit, especially air to airs. Ooh, and doesn't armor through the return right there. Fuck Armors yeah. through. Went for another money shot, but didn't get it. Nice hands here with the stand one. Slayer's really controlling the pace here. No conversion. Oh, here we go. Meatless corner combo. Very nice. A lot of damage. Meterless right into the corner set with the Caltrops, but Slayer is fighting his way out. Oh, and it catches him on the way back, but no oh, conversion. No conversion. I was close, though. How you like me? Nice. Slayer is one round away. Try. And he has Sonic Fox in the corner, and Fox only has one bar to work with. Yeah, Fox is going to have to do something crazy here, and that is not it. Getting not hit by an overhead. Yeah, overhead. Not yeah. gonna... Oh, but that is a mistake from Slayer. Slayer's just jumping around like a madman. Yeah, this here. is this is play that we don't normally see from Slayer either. He's not the type that's always just jumping all over the place. It's working right but now yeah, though. He's, a, he's realizing that Aaron Black cannot control the air as much as Sonic Fox would like, so he's right. just taking advantage of it. And look at Slayer that. Slayer right getting there. very close. Another overhead. One more hit is going to send out Fox, it. and he's going to do it. So Slayer beating oh, Fox. The oh, the counterbags! Two weeks in a row. Uh, Slayer may be the Sonic Fox killer. I mean, that is why he is amply named the King Slayer right now. It's kind of perfect. He's in like a like a hunter outfit right now. Right. The 